Let's learn how to do a rock bow in old time music in two or three minutes. Let's see how fast we can make this. There's a lot of confusion over how to do it. And one of the best ways to make it happen is first of all, to understand that the rock bow is not alternating notes. It's not or the rock bow is a double stop on the down bow and then an up bow on a single drone note. So if you have two notes, let's just say you're open A and you're open D. On the down bow, your beat, you're gonna go on both those strings evenly. And on the up bow, you're gonna go just on the lower of the two. Now you're gonna pull a little harder than you push. You see how I'm working my way down the bow when I do that? That's inevitable and part of the rock bow. You can do it with fingers on. Here we have a G chord, third finger on the G note, first finger B note. And here we have. You can change the note. Another way to look at this when you're thinking about a rock bow is that of the two notes you're playing, one of them is being played all the time. Let's look at Old Molly Hair. This D note is being played both on the down bow and on the up bow. The only thing we're doing is we're adding and removing the top note. Here's the drone. And here we'll add the top note. And now we'll add it as a rock bow. It'll sound a little robotic if you do it perfectly evenly. You want your down bows to be bigger. Same thing on the G chord. Hear that the G note, it's constant. So listen to how that sounds. Or and that's how you do a rock bow.